everyone it's vicky here from crafty heaven and thank you very much for joining me today and today we have a new release from simply made crafts and this collection is called bohemian days and it's absolutely gorgeous so as always i'm going to show you the products first and then i'll show you my samples and i've also got a very special um, extra project that i want to show you that is not a part of my sample but it is using the new product that's in this collection and I'm going to give you a sneak peek of that I'm not going to show you it fully because I want it to be um, you know not shown until the tutorial has come out so let's get on with the products first so the first product is the stamp set so this is called Bohemian Days stamp set and as you can see we have this gorgeous dream catcher and then we have this one here then we've got some feathers a moon we've got a star a crystal and then we've got these borders stamps here we have some arrows and yeah it's gorgeous and as you can see we've got some sentiments so we've got happy birthday come true follow your dreams may your hope your so yeah that's the gorgeous stamp set to go with this collection we have got the small album die set so this and this album die set coordinates with this new collection small so album pop-up frame die set so this is Helen's sample here and these can be made into cards or it can be added as a page insert into your album. You can do so many things with these dies. Then we have the small album pocket page inserts die set. So we have this page here with the tab on top and then this page with the tab on the side and we have these tabs on these pages so then you can layer two of these together and they open up as a page and then you can insert these as well into your pockets into your album the small shadow frame album box die set so if you remember a couple of months ago when Helen brought out her Christmas collection she had brought out the large shadow frame album box die set well this one is slightly smaller than this one so here is Helen's sample for that small album photo peekaboo die set again here is Helen's sample and again you can add these into your pages you could even add it into a pocket or even make it into a card which is what I've done as well as added it into my album we have the ephemera so i'll pop them into this case so this is called bohemian days ephemera and i just love how bright and colorful these are so we have a mixture of ephemera so we've got some flowers and leaves and some hearts we have these diamond shaped ones we also have some sentiments and let's have a look we've got these gorgeous birds so there is another bird in here here we go and i just think these are so pretty and i just love the bright colors of them so that's the ephemera and then finally we have the bohemian days patterned paper so not all of these are 12 by 12 because I've used majority of them. So the ones I've used and haven't got left, I've printed onto some A4 cardstock. So then you can still see what the design of that paper looks like. So I'll show you the ones that I've got left in the 12 by 12 first. So we have this gorgeous pink one. And look how stunning they are. Then we have this one, so you could have it either way. Perfect for masculine cards. Then this one has to be 
my favourite. Then we've got this one. And then I've printed them onto some A4 cards. So we also have this one, but obviously you will get it in the 12 by 12. It's just I've ran out in this design. We've got this brick wall. And then we have this one. So how gorgeous are those patterned papers? So the first one, I got asked to make a box for my mini album to go in. So this is what I come up with. And I stamped my dream catcher and these arrows here in some clear ink and embossed that with white embossing powder. And then I've got the sentiment as well from the stamp set, follow your, and then I use the ephemera that, and this says dream and I've just added some of the other ephemera and then I've just got this bow in the corner and then this is what it looks like on the side and then when you open it up it reveals the small mini album and then that's what that looks like inside then the next thing I got asked to do was to make the mini album decorate the covers and also add some pockets and those page inserts inside the covers so this is what the album looks like and i use the ephemera to decorate the front that is the side and then that is the back with that beautiful bird so then when we open it up inside i've actually got two pockets here so this is the first one and i've decorated it with some of the ephemera so i've got these pages in here so we've got another pocket there with this pull out page so when you die cut them out they will be this side but this one i actually trimmed down so it could be slightly smaller so you can have it whatever height you want them this is the first one and i just love the tabs on the top okay and then obviously that will go in there like that and then we have the smaller one and that's what that looks like so they just slot in there then we come to the back cover and again, I've got this side pocket here and I've just added some more ephemera this page here that pulls out. And this is the one with the tab on the side. And I just love these. Aren't they brilliant? The thing I got asked to do was to do two double pages. So we have this one here and then we've got this one here. So the first one is using... I've used is the small album pop-up frame die set okay so this is what this page looks like got some photo mats here where you can add your photos I've got some of the ephemera there so when you open mine up I've done a double photo layout on this sample here it is just the one photo section but I just wanted to change it up a bit and added the two circles. So that's that one. And then the, the next double page layout I used the small album photo peekaboo die set. So again, on this side, we've got a space for a photo. And you pull that to reveal some more areas where you can add your photo. I have these pull out photo mats that are in the top of our pages so they just go in there like so so that is my album with my two double layout pages and then I've also got my box for my album to go in then I was asked to make kind of like a home decor project using the small shadow frame box die set and this is what i come up with now this did take me a bit of time because i had to do some 
cutting out of my images from the stamps and then I did some stitching so can you see that metallic thread that's on the dream catches and oh, I think it's so pretty and then I added some of these beads cut out some of the feathers stamped them and then I stuck them on and then just added some ephemera just to decorate that up and I think it is gorgeous and so I decided to make this eighth birthday card the photo peekaboo die set I have a card base and then this just pulls open like that to reveal the happy birthday on there and I've just used the diamond ephemera to decorate that there we go. that is all my samples and the new collection from simply made crafts i did promise you a sneak peek of another project that i've made using the small shadow frame box die set here so is a quick sneak peek are you ready okay there we go <laughs> that's all you're getting <laughs> so keep an eye out for that and it will be up on my channel very soon but I really hope that you enjoyed this new collection that is released from Simply Made Crafts as always the links for any of the products will be listed down below so go and check them out if you enjoyed this video please give me a big thumbs up if you haven't subscribed to my channel then please click on my profile picture which is this circle here somewhere <laughs> that will pop up and also go and check out some other videos from me on my youtube channel by clicking on this video that will pop up here as well so till next time guys take care and i will see you all very soon bye for now